Hello everyone and welcome back to Spyro Enter the Dragonfly Blind. On the last episode, we had another episode of a collectathon where we uh Shut up Spyro. Where we uh now that we have the ice breath, we were able to go to the eastern side of the Dragon Realms to go see how that was going on over there. And we managed to find all the gems and get all of the dragonflies. So that's one level done. Hooray! Uh, we used uh, the rest of the time then to head back over to Dragonfly Dojo and actually finish it off. Uh, but one, by actually going through the end portal for the first time and getting the Dragonfly for completing the task in the level. And uh, also doing all the rest of the tasks, which involved uh, freezing those baby dragons so that we could climb on top of them and get their kites. And uh, heading inside that tank area, which did trash on us once. But after going through that, we got the final Dragonfly. So that's two levels done. Hooray! Uh, on this episode, though, we're going to be going through the next new level, uh, Monkey Monastery, I think is what it's called. I think it's Monkey Monastery, then it's Honey... something. Honey Marsh. Got Honey Marsh, Thieves' Den, and then Jurassic Jungle. We're already halfway through this game. We have, mo we have more than half of the gems, and we have less than half of the dragonflies, but I think that's going to change this episode. Because we only need four to get to Honey Marsh. So we're going to get the probably the seven that we can get from Monkey Monastery without going into any of the special areas. And hopefully we get all the gems. I'd love to get all the gems. <laughs> it would be way less of a hassle if I could just get those. All right, let's find out. What? The, is the Monkey Man supposed to be here? Because he's just completely gone. Hello? Were any of the other guys gone? Hmm. That looked weird. <laughs> that looked a little weird. It's nice I'm taking a, a balloon over there, though. Harkens back to Spyro 1, even if this one is uh, an iron basket. The, cl the, the dark clouds... Doesn't bode well. Don't bode well. Hello there, sir. Those unbalanced Riptox have invaded our sacred monastery. Of course, we practice divine compassion, so we really can't get involved in anything violent. You know, you're not the first monks we've seen. <laughs> We did see those ones back in Colossus, and I mean they weren't they weren't that kind either. Oh, he's actually flying, or else he's holding himself up with his tail. These people look a lot like Agent Nine did, which probably makes sense because they're monkeys. Oh, they got cute little mammoths! How awful of me! <laughs> I feel I feel awful. That thing that thing just wanted a hug. All right, so there's more frozen things here. What else could that possibly be up there? And it looks like there's nothing underneath the water, so. I completely forgot I could slide on ice. Get back here, get back here. I don't get a charge when I'm on the ice, though, which is unfortunate. Oh, wow, he got me. There we go. Hey, it's foamy. I would have laughed if that cracked the ice and I would have died from it. <laughs> like, there's just a bottomless pit underneath this. It's like, yeah, that's deserved. Okay, I'm being very thorough. Was that... Wait. <laughs> Wait, hold on. What are these things looking at? They have creepy looking eyes. I think I'm going to be worried about my... Uh, why'd I charge that? I'm going to be worried about my fire breath mostly this level. I have to say, that looked familiar. Uh, 
Actually, from this angle, I'm not sure. Wait, wait, wait. Is that a Yeti? We were just talking about Colossus. And how the Yeti was like the end thing there. That could be a Yeti. Alright, well, it didn't stop my charge when I ran to that door, so I think that opens up. There is a dragonfly on the other side of that door, though. What is this? Hello? Uh, okay. Is there any way to get up there? No. Does not look like it. And I definitely don't want to go down. Oh boy. These ice things are going to be so annoying. <laughs> Especially if they keep my momentum. Which they're not really doing all that much, so I doubt they will. Eh. Oh, they're kind of keeping my momentum. Oh, this poor, this poor defenseless mammoth. This poor defenseless mammoth. Why haven't we fought anything else? For all the evil rip talks, not these cute things. It could help it. All right, finally got some rip talks. Oh God. Did I get him? He just went ham with that icicle. <laughs> Okay, these these butter these these butterflies these bunnies are getting on my nerve. Oh wait, what? Hello? Okay, we're talking to you. Spyro, I know you've heard that Yeti are scary monsters, but we are peaceful, which is why we live here in this once peaceful realm. The true monsters are the Riptox, and they've taken my kind and imprisoned them in the ice. Can you save the five Yeti with your flame breath? Why does Bartholomew look so familiar? Okay, I charge you. I don't... God, he looks familiar. He must have been in the third game, but I cannot remember for the life of me. All right, well, I got hurt. I was like, Barth I almost said, hey, it's Bartholomew. And then I realized, why would I say that? <laughs> I was like, do I know who he is? I must. Ooh, look at that wall over there. Leave me alone. Ouch. Ow. All right, looks like I can go over there and have like a little puzzle. That was weird. I bet I have to use the Yeti's power to get through here. Because there's no way I can do it. Unless there's a... You know what we haven't seen in a while? Supercharge? I was just seeing all these, like, twists and turns. And I'm thinking, oh, maybe there's a supercharge thing around here somewhere. Maybe. I don't see anything, like, set up. There's a... Is that a... Is that a gun? <laughs> <laughs> maybe maybe not supercharged. Maybe instead gun. Have fun. Okay, this isn't ice. I thought this was ice, and I was, I was very worried picking up that gem. You know, they haven't... How many levels have there been in Spire where it's just pure ice? I, You know what? I said that out loud, and I realized Ice Cavern from Spire 1 is... <laughs> Very ice. There was Colossus. It wasn't really that. It didn't seem cold. This level seems cold. What does what does this guy want? Can I help you with anything? Greetings, young dragon. I believe the turret behind you could be a very useful weapon for you to use on your quest. We use it for our annual snowball war. Oh, it's quite an event. Although we are a non-violent people, we do have our vices. Perhaps you might want to glide over there and try it out. We have a snowball turret? <laughs> and that's a vice? Okay. Whatever works. There's a lot of things here to blow up, apparently, using this ice. 
or using the snowball machine. Let's see. That looked like a missile. Did not look like a snowball. What do I? What do I hit the Yeti? Nothing happens. It's like I froze him instead. Do these guys take damage? Goes right over their heads. Oh, I can. I can arc it. Does it even. It doesn't affect gravity anyway, so. So much for that. Why aim it up if there's nothing to shoot up? Hi, right, Mr. Yeti. Oh boy, almost missed that. Oh, I like the cold, but I don't like it that much. Uh, that's that is a hundred percent not the voice I expected. <laughs> I mean, the Yetis originally didn't have any voices except for Bentley, and he had like, what kind of accent did he have? I don't remember. Yeah, I'm going down here. Just to see what's up here. I mean, this seems like just a random extra path. Is there a dragonfly up here? Or is it just these just these gems and enemies? No, no, there's a dragonfly up here. Oh, this dragonfly's gonna send me on a wild goose chase. I can't wait. I did get that gem right there, right? Right, 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 yep, mm-hmm. Oh, please be kind. Pretty please be kind. Oh, wow, look at this gem right at the corner. Give me that. I don't even know where he went. Oh, you're just rude. Stop moving so I can get you. There we go. Oh God. Hey, it's Holly. Tell me I'm still on this floor. Okay, good. Yeah, you know, I'll give this game credit. They're taking some risks by having an actual reflection. <laughs> I mean, I mean, did I can't even remember if Spyro two or three did, but I certainly they did. I mean, they're just, they, they had to remake the Spyro engine for this. It's just unfortunate that they didn't have like any time to fix the frame rate or loading times or add anything new. Have we seen anything new other than, I don't know, the, the breaths. I mean, that's kind of new. But one breath is purely for catching dragonflies and another breath well, the other breath are just fire breath, but with a different shade. Although ice breath does do what ice breath did near the dragon. And electric breath does have some electric capabilities on certain items. Whoa, I'm going super fast. Whoa, whoa. Why is this, why is this piece of ice so fast? Okay, all right. Gotta make sure I don't miss anything. Oh. Wow, I think I grazed him, but he still went down. All right, I'll take it. There's five Yeti. I've only seen two. We only freed one. There's gotta be one in there. Wow, look how big this area is. Oh God, vultures. Oh no, oh no, leave. Leave, Manny! Go away! I'm sorry. Wow. Oh. Hey. Not cool, bro. There we go. Oh! <laughs> Almost fell. Well, okay, okay, that was a long distance. Spyro! These flying Riptocks are a menace! Oh, I think they are guarding the Yetis trapped within the ice here. 
Can you use the turrets to help free them? I mean, I wouldn't see it any other way. Is, is this how I'm going to have to aim up for this? Please tell me I can hold the Y button down and get the first person view. I didn't try it. Because I don't know if it works. Oh god, I'm taking it very careful here. Sparks, it's up to you to grab these. I'm too chicken. Alright, good, 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 good. Okay, there's another Yeti up there. There's our third one. Ooh, a Zoe save? Oh, please. Oh god, I keep on forgetting I have to charge you. Did I just see Santa Slay? Please tell me that's that's not Santa Slay. <laughs> No, no first person view. A headshot though. Okay, hold on. Let's just shoot that one straight. Wait, what? Really? It's like right there. I got the one. Oh, there's a turret down there. Okay. Wait, so. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. This turret's still useful. Is it still useful? I can't aim down and shoot that. Okay, never mind. I hit anyway. Got some platforms over there. Is that the end portal? Really? Okay. So from here. Where do I go from here? I guess I go. I don't think I go that way. There must be like an opening underneath me. That sounds vicious. Take that. Miss. Lead my shot. There we go. God, this is some, just some creepy laughing. challenge who's laughing stop it it's so it's so nerve-wracking I'm getting out of here it's like they have the it's like they have a speaker underneath the turret and it's supposed to psych whoever's in it out it's like oh you're gonna miss your snowball throw as you hear very very painful sounding laughter Say that Yeti. It's a good thing you came along when you did, Dragon. Thank you, weird sounding Yeti. I'm still not used to their voices. So I guess from here I just go down to the portal. Because I really don't have anywhere else I could fly to. There are the platforms that are uh, to the right of me. That doesn't seem correct, though. I think it's supposed to be going from the other way. I don't know. How do I get to that Yeti? Flying over there just seems wrong. Also, there's a giant sheet of ice. I need to shoot it down. You make me do this game. All right, there's a there's our first firework. We haven't seen any of these in a while. I guess I'm supposed to fly using that. How's it going? I haven't saved all the Yetis yet, so I'm gonna I'm I refuse to speak to you. Nah, let's speak to you. I gotta find out. The end portal being there is weird. 
Wow! That was more than I expected, but, uh, thanks. You're welcome. You got nothing. All right. It, like, I feel like I feel like we've only done half the stuff here. We haven't looked at our uh, our gem total so far, so we might be over half. I don't know. We're still missing three Yeti. Okay, that's how you get to the first one. All right. Ooh, look at that! Did you see that? There's a barrel right there. I get up there. How do I get up there? I bet there's a path back here somewhere. Okay, so there's that whole area behind me, which I feel like I might be able to reach now that that, uh, that wall's out of the way. Why does this look like this part isn't connected to the rest of the the rest of the floor? I'm gonna feel stupid if there's something if there was something inside Bartholomew's house, because boy, it feels like I could have opened that door using something. Those tricky rip talks caught me off guard, Spyro. Many thanks for your help. You're welcome, Gunther. <laughs> His name is Gunther. All right. Ooh. Did my fly stop because I hit the fire? It felt weird. I'm confused about this mysterious path that's right above me, but I, well, I'll just worry about that later. Cheerio, Spyro. That's a good dragon. Okay. I already forgot what your name was. I'm so sorry. Oh, this door is open now. Oh, look at that. Why did it open up now? Miss. There we go. Hey, it's Damsel. All right, that gets us enough to get to the next level. So anything else now is working towards the next level after that. Good. Yeah, we just unlocked like the second half here. Oh boy, that was bubbles. <laughs> I just got obliterated. I got obliterated because I actually had my bubble breath out. Oops. Alright, so this leads up to the those barrels that we just saw. Uh-huh. Or baskets, whatever. Hey, it's Shadow. I did not know there was a dragonfly up here. Alright, that's uh I feel like we've okay, we had 41 when we entered. We have we're at 46 now, so that's five dragonflies. Not bad. We get a dragonfly for rescuing all the Yeti. Got to find out who to talk to for that. And then there's at least one more dragonfly around here, I think. Ooh, there's a portal up here. All right. Ignoring that. What's around it? A couple flags. Ice golf? I don't know. Please not hockey. We did enough hockey in, uh, in Spyro 1. Spyro 2. Okay, I think I think what I'm supposed to do now is go back to where we were. And now that we cleared out that ice wall, we can probably progress past that. Also, what is this? Miss. Hmm. I don't got anything. It, it seemed like the old treasure chest that we had before where it has a key. We haven't seen a key. Oh, you know what? I bet I talked with Bartholomew to get my uh, reward for the Yeti. Now that I think about it. Hey, can I go inside your house? Ouch. Eh. Can I look inside your house? 
No. Hey, calm down, you're rescued. This is good, this is good. Just in case I accidentally missed like a gem somewhere. Yeah, that whole section behind this mountain over here is weird. I guess we'll find out. There is one more Yeti. I do know where it is. We do know where it is because it's, it's way off in the distance here. Got that guy. He's free. We got the guy. Yeah, right there. There's the last Yeti. Oh, look at that. We got the key. God, I do not trust these platforms at all. Ho, oh, oh. ho. I don't know how I managed to risk that. I did, though. Okay, I can at least bump into the wall just a tiny bit. There's another portal here. Yeesh. That's going to be a nightmare to get back to. There is a balloon on it. Is that for the Monkey Monastery itself or because something balloon themed? All oh, the gems! Hooray! Whoa, what happened? I feel like an ice lolly. Did those rip talks put me on ice? He gads. Thank you, Spyro. He said gosh. How dare he? <laughs> Alright, I don't know what what's the purpose of you, hello? Wow, that was more than I expected, but, uh, thanks. Why have the monkeys if they don't do anything for the story? <laughs> this seems like a Yeti homeworld, but no, it's, it's, it's monkeys and Yetis. Because they didn't give us anything. They didn't even give us a task. They just said rescue this place. Ooh, what's inside here then? Oh, it must be a dragonfly, obviously. It's young. Oh, I just straight up just get it. We don't even get to see it. It's an invisible dragonfly. Why did that chest have a seashell on it? <laughs> that seems kind of out of place. You know those famous beaches in the in the Arctic. Thank you, Spyro. The Yeti will always welcome you with open arms. It's Joy. Did we just get two there? Hello? There's seven out of ten. We got all the gems. But why did it show two blue why did it show two blue dragonflies? On the loose, save the Yetis. On the ledge, locked in a chest. Maybe, maybe one of those were, uh, were young. That would make sense. Hunting whip talks. Oh, the the winged rip talks. <laughs> on thin ice. Behind the doors. Where was on thin ice at? Oh, is that the one that's like right above where we currently are? Or is that on the ledge? Doesn't matter. I remember to press start this time that way i didn't get accidentally teleport out of here all right well i think we've done everything we can without going into the secret realms so off to the portal we go to leave properly we did good we got all the gems got every dragonfly we can get without going into any uh sub areas and we uh we rescued all the yetis took care of all the rip talks 
Got a key, opened up a chest, and uh, didn't die. Not bad. Hooray. We're heroes. Now we'll just have to come back to this level and do the side stuff. And hopefully none of the side stuff are hair pulling out, inducing. <laughs> The only one we the only two we've done so far has been the speedway and the tank thing, and they haven't been that bad, so. Maybe this game will be like the easiest Spyro completion after one. Although Spyro 1 did have some tough moments, but I mean five hours to finish. Not that not that hard. I get nervous walking in every portal now, since the last episode where it crashed on us. Almost 5,000 treasure. Not bad. The way there and back seems way more cloudy and dark than the rest of the level. I don't remember it being that dark in Monkey Monastery. Then again, I don't remember seeing the clouds all that much. All right. Well, we'll come back to that level in a moment, or later on. Yep, level two, this level's complete. Ooh, boy. I mean, to be fair, Spyro 2 and 3, I think, also had that level complete thing pop up whenever you went into a level. I don't know if it did it every single time we went inside the main hub world, but whatever. So... We now have enough... Oh, we gotta go all the way back. <laughs> we gotta go all the way to the west side. To go to Honey Marsh's portal and talk with the uh, the Gator, Farmer Gator, not, not Hippo King. Go see what he wants over there. Honey Marsh, and then we have Thieves' Den right next to us, which we need seven more dragonflies, so that shouldn't be bad. Ooh, how's this going to work? Seven more dragonflies for that. We might have to do another episode of the Collectathon just to get three more dragonflies. I mean, make your pick. We could choose any level. Maybe we choose like a level that we don't have all the gems in, so we have some we have another reason to go back into it. So let <laughs> Lou Island or Cloud Nine. Quick uh quick collectathon episode, and then we can finish off with Jurassic Jungle and then start like the end game collectathon before we head through that floor portal, I think. <laughs> how's that how's that supposed to activate when we get to it? We haven't heard of any way to activate that thing in the main hub area. Next to the statue. Where Ripto came out of. Uh, well, I guess we'll find out later. Maybe we'll get another cutscene or something. So, until next time. Hopefully you enjoy. Dun, 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 dun.